Hey guys, it's James with the Chart Guys. It is Wednesday, October 12th. Uh, I'm going to do my nightly video on oil. It's I've been on hiatus because I haven't had a computer to do videos properly on, but I've got a new computer and so I'm back in action. So let's start with oil. Um, so oil had this inside candlestick here and I always, uh, let me get rid of this drawing. I always preach the importance of, of watching the, those inside candlesticks. The, the high and low of this candlestick is in, in the high and low of the previous candlestick. Once we broke that, you can see the breakdown um, and it has some more downside here. So on the daily, where can we find some support on oil? First, we will look to the high here. Uh, remaining at 49.36 is the next level I'm looking at for some support. So 49.36, I'll be on watch for it tomorrow. Going into the inventory reports, if it gets there, um, and see if bulls buy the dip going into the inventory reports is something to be aware of. But currently on the daily, it looks like it's just a healthy little pullback so far, nothing to be concerned with. Um, and bulls are just trying to cool down, gather some strength, and move back up. On the hourly, once we lost the 20 MA, which pretty much coincides with that uh, break to the downside on the inside candlestick on the daily. Um, you can see that we've had some more downside. So watch how it reacts to the 200 MA currently at 49.69. Uh, watch a back test of the 20 MA resistance, this purple line. And if it rejects from there, expect more downside. And I expect it to reach that resistance. I mean, that support level I've I've said, talked about the 49.36, so something to watch for. Again, it's just a healthy pullback on oil. Nothing to be concerned about for oil bulls um, yet. So 49.36, then 48.46, then 47.75. I, If it does reach 47.75, I would be surprised, but I do expect it, the uh, oil bulls to defend that level. And resistance currently is, again, back at 50. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Remember, watch and wait for inventory reports. Uh, see you in the morning.